Health officials say social distancing is working, but they do warn it could be a while still before life goes back to some kind of normal. The shutdown is also crippling small businesses, and there's now a new push to give them more financial help. Skylar Henry reports from the White House. Small businesses shuttered as a result of the coronavirus pandemic are rushing to tap into $350 billion in government loans. 178,000 loans from 3,000 banks. I mean, that is very cool. You just got to admit that. That is everyone's, and that's just what we had hoped to kind of, you know, keep people afloat. More money is already needed because of the overwhelming demand. If we run out of funds, by the way, we're already preparing because it's going so fast for the small businesses and their employees. Uh, we'll ask Congress to refill it immediately. Senate leaders say they are working to approve up to $250 billion more for loans. Aye. Uh, with a voice vote as early as this week. President Trump is scheduled to speak with small business owners this afternoon. He has said that businesses will recover quickly once the social distancing restrictions are lifted. I think we can get more than back to normal from an economic standpoint. It would actually be better. But Dr. Anthony Fauci warned that life won't return to normal until there's an approved coronavirus vaccine. If back to normal means acting like there never was a coronavirus problem, I don't think that's going to happen until we do have a situation where you can completely protect the population. For now, health experts recommend staying at home, even suggesting people cut back on trips to the grocery store. This is a highly transmittable virus. Um, we've been saying that we want every American to know that what they're doing is making a difference. A vaccine isn't expected until next year. Skylar Henry, CBS News, the White House.